In today's episode, you will learn how to change the name and PIN code or password of the Bluetooth module using AD commands. It doesn't matter whether you're using HC05 or HC06 Bluetooth module. There is a very little change in the AD commands, while use of both the Bluetooth modules is exactly the same. Without any further delay, let's get started. Components needed are a number one Arduino, number two HC05 or HC06 Bluetooth module. The one you can see on the screen is HC05, but if you want, you can also use HC06. I will explain the AD commands used for the HC06 Bluetooth module, and finally, number three, some male to female type jump wires. These components can be purchased from Amazon. The components purchase links are given in the description. This is the HC05 Bluetooth module. As you can see, I have already connected some jumper wires so that it can be easily interfaced with the Arduino. It has a total of six male headers, clearly labeled with state, RXD, TXT, ground, VCC, and EN. The EN pin also has a push button which is used for activating the AD command mode, which I will explain in a minute. Now before we interface the Bluetooth module with the Arduino, first let's open a basic Arduino sketch consisting of the wide setup and wide loop functions. As you can see these functions has no coding before you upload this program. First of all make sure that the Arduino is connected with the laptop and the right board and right COM board is selected. Then click on the upload button and wait for a while. As you can see the program has been uploaded and now let's interface the Bluetooth module with the Arduino. Connect the EN pin of the Bluetooth module with 3.3 volts. Connect the VCC of the Bluetooth module with 5 volts. Connect the ground with the Arduino's ground. Connect the RX pin of the Bluetooth module with the RX pin of the Arduino and connect the TX pin of the Bluetooth module with the TX pin of the Arduino. So we are done with the interfacing. Let's first remove the EN pin and power of the Arduino and see what happens. As you can see the LED is blinking fast which means that the Bluetooth module is not in the AD commands mode. Disconnect Arduino. Press the push button. Connect the EN pin with 3.3 volt and again connect Arduino with the laptop. Now you can see the LD is blinking at a slow rate which means that the Bluetooth module is entered into the AT commands mode. As I said earlier, the HC05 and HC06 Bluetooth modules are exactly the same, but has a very little change in the AT commands. For example, for HC06, the AT plus pin command is used to set the pin number or password. 80 plus pin 1, 2, 3, 4. This command sets the pin. Enter any 4 digit number like, for example, 80 plus pin 4321. While the name is set using the 80 plus name command followed by the name you want to set. 80 plus name and a device name. But as I'm going to use HC05 Bluetooth module, so I will use the 80 plus. PSWD and AT plus name commands. Now let's open the serial monitor. Select the desired baud rate which is 38,400. And select both NL and CR. After these settings are completed then simply type AT and enter. As you can see the AD command is working. Let's check the default password or pin code of the Bluetooth module. 
For this use AD plus PSWD command. As you can see its password is 1234. To change this password write AD plus PSWD equals 4321 or any other four digit number. Now let's check again if the password is changed to 4321. As you can see, now the password is 4321. Now let's check the name of the Bluetooth module using AD plus name command. As you can see, its name is HC-05. Now let's change its name to Electronic Clinic. As you can see, the name is changed to Electronic Clinic. So this is how easily we can change the password and name of the Bluetooth module using the AD commands. Now let's connect this Bluetooth module with the cell phone. As all the settings are done now, disconnect the Arduino and also remove the wire which is connecting the EN pin of the Bluetooth module with 3.3 volts of the Arduino. We don't need this wire anymore. Now again turn on the Arduino. As you can see, the LED is blinking fast which means that this is not in AT commands mode and also it's not connected with the cell phone. Now let's connect this with the cell phone. I will do screen recording on the cell phone. Now you can see it's connected with the cell phone as the LD is blinking at the slower rate. Support me on Patreon for more videos. I hope you liked today's episode. Like and share this video with your friends. See you in next episode and thanks for watching.